Hey guys, welcome to Exam Tricks. Today we are going to learn to convert reoccurring, repeating, non-terminating decimal into fractions. So let us take an example of that number, like 0 0.777 and so on. It's not terminating and it's repeating. Its answer is 7 by 9. Simple. I will tell you how the answer came later on. So let us take another example. Say 0 0.242424 and so on. Its fraction is 24 by 99. And let us take another example. Say 0 0.357. 357 357 and so on so the fraction is 357 by 999 so it's pretty easy to find out the fraction so how it is coming we will see that okay so let us generate a formula by seeing these three examples so what we are seeing the, the number repeating here 777 seven, seven is in the numerator and in the denominator the number repeating is one digit number so the denominator is the maximum of one digit number here 24 is repeating so we have written 24 and this is a two digit number so maximum of two digit number is 99 likewise here 357 it is a three digit number so denominator will be a maximum of three digit number that is 999 so we will generate a formula that is number re occurring by the max digit number of reoccurring possible okay so this is the formula now we will see how it came we will solve it thoroughly say we will take the first example like 0 0.777 so uh, what what is this 0 0.777 and so on so let this number be x okay what what we have to do is multiply both side by 10 then it becomes 7.7 .7 and this becomes 10x now what we have to do is subtract this equation by this equation subtract this equation from this equation it becomes 7 which is equal to 9x what we did 10x minus x which is equal to 9x 7.77 and so on minus 0 0.777 becomes 7 so what is the value of x it becomes 7 by 9 so what we did wrote here 7, 7 by 9 so we saw how it is solved but we can directly write the answer now we will see the second case it is 0 0.242424 and so on. Let this number be x. Now as two digits are repeating 2 and 4, 2 and 4. So we will multiply both sides by 100. So it becomes 24.242424 and so on. And this becomes 100x. Now same subtract this x from 100x and this number from this number becomes 24 is equal to 99x this implies x is equal to 24 by 99 so what we wrote here comes like this i hope you are getting this now we will solve the third one third one is 0 0.357357 and so on let this number be x now as we are seeing it, it is a three digit number so we will multiply multiply it by 1000 it becomes 357.357357 and so on. It becomes 
1000 x now subtract this x from 1000 x and this from this becomes 3 5 7 is equal to 999 x this implies x is equal to 3 5 7 by 999 9. now see this number and see this number are they same yes so hope you like this trick we will be making more subscribe to our channel that is exam trick thank you